It's been nearly two months since that brutal attack happened. Tonight, the man accused of that crime is no longer in a public hospital bed. He's in a facility for criminals. It's the first time we are seeing the 19 year old man accused of committing a double murder that made international headlines. Austin Haroff, who appeared to look dazed and remain silent, was released from the hospital Monday afternoon. Deputies from the U.S. Marshals Fugitive Task Force were there to take him to the Martin County Jail. So we charged him with two counts of first degree murder and one count of attempted first degree murder. On August 15th, Haroff was found by deputies biting the face and body of John Stevens in Stevens' Jupiter driveway. Stevens' wife, Michelle Mishkan, stabbed to death in the garage. Deputies say Haroff also stabbed a neighbor who tried to help. We've been in constant contact uh, with uh, our female victims, mother and father. They've been very concerned uh, that, that he hasn't been arrested yet. I'm, I'm hoping this will give them some measure of relief. What would you like to say, Austin? Sheriff Snyder says Haroff will not be with other prisoners right away. My understanding is that he will probably continue to need therapy. Uh, we've made it clear to the hospital that this is a jail. This is not a, uh, a therapeutic uh, place to be. I suppose that because he's in medical, there will be some extra charges. We won't be able to put him into general population immediately. Sheriff Snyder says a private contractor handles all the medical needs for prisoners here. Meanwhile, investigators are still waiting for Haroff's toxicology reports. Investigators want to know if he had any type of drugs in his system. We